Welcome back everybody. Guess what just happened? We just got an update for Stonehearth. It is the Stonehearth Alpha 4 update. Holy crap guys. I am so ready for this. Here if you can take a quick little glance at all the new things. We got like, uh, we got the footman. Oh, okay, this is, uh, actually this, they didn't update this. Okay, this isn't updated. Either way, this is gonna be great guys. I am psyched for this. So I'll talk about the new features as we start up a new game here. We're gonna have a let's play. This is just gonna be a quick little preview on uh, what the game currently has right now and then uh, after this we'll just do like a huge let's play it'll be great hopefully we won't run into too many bugs because I know they're there I've seen them many times ah uh, bugs I love them guys you can't you just can't get over them so basically we got some few new items in here we got like the uh, the flowers that you can place down now we've got new uh, farming things that you can grow now we've got a whole new slew of things so basically we're gonna start down cutting down we're gonna start off cutting down these goddamn trees Start up a little stockpile. Here we go, guys. And uh, as you can see right here, we got some new icons for the uh, farmer and the uh, trapper. The trapper is uh, a new class in the game. So let's see here. What are we going to do here first? Okay, first thing I'm going to show you guys is the new... Oh, let's see here. What should we... Okay, the new build menu. So our first building will be pretty small. I'll just show you guys a quick glance. So basically, we'll start off a standard house. You can see all the customization going on over here. And uh, we got the roof, new roof, got some new roof types. As you can see, you can just fill around with that. And we can do some, we can do like a door right about here. Perfect, there's our little house right there. And how do we click plus escape to cancel? How do we, uh, how do we start building? Is there already a glitch? Jesus, guys, so many glitches. It's crazy. So yeah, there's like the new build menu. I wish I could show you it. But, yeah, to be honest, so, yeah, so if you, uh, click this new place an item thing, all of the items that are in your, uh, crafting, I mean, not crafting, stockpile, like, other than, like, wood and stone and, like, the, uh, class items, I guess, you'll be able to, uh, place them in here. Also, we have the new ladders, which basically you'll be able to, uh, gain up elevation, which is pretty cool, so say if I wanted to, uh, come over here, gain this elevation, you could do that now. And uh, let's see what else is there that's pretty new. We could show you. Did they change this? That nope, they did not change this. So this is all standard. Then we got all of our citizens over here as usual. We've got the managed crafters and professions, professions, and we have the uh, red alert mode. As you guys all know, everybody just drops all their stuff and just starts, you know, attacking anything in sight. So let's see. We'll start with the uh, the crafter. So we'll put down the carpenter. Choose a citizen. Yada yada yada. You know, all the regular stuff, so basically right here. I'll show you guys the new... Oh, we got a new animation, too. It's great. So we'll come over here, build the workshop. Here we go. And I'll just quickly show you guys, run you guys all through the uh, new items and stuff that you can get. So we can get the new weaver spindle. We can get the farmer so and the uh, wooden practice sword, as you guys can see there. My workers are just going to, uh, you know, do that whilst we promote somebody into a trapper. Beth. I mean, who doesn't love Beth? So we'll show off that. We'll get this farmer. And we'll just promote Sean into a farmer. Oh, they added some new hair types too, which is pretty cool. So now we can start doing the farming. Here we go. Just, you know, farm out a pretty big area right here. Oh, crap. And uh, so this is the corn. We got the turnip. And this is the uh, new silkweed that you're able to grow to uh, craft uh, various items such as cloth which can be turned into uh, I mean thread which can be turned into cloth which the weaver can use so basically we can uh, you know start making some silk weed if we want there you go and then we got the uh oh yeah here we go this is the new uh trappers I guess we should say UI oh didn't mean to click that where is it where's the trapper here he is so basically we could say okay trapper come over here to search this whole area uh let's see here there you go, bang. All the way. So the trap will just come over here, look for anything that she can find, and uh, basically trap any animals that are in this area. Or actually put down traps that will trap your animals that will put like uh, in this area. So that's pretty cool. And then uh, as you can see over here, we got this going. So hopefully the silk weed won't take too long. We'll get two farmers to make it uh, actually go faster. So let's craft another one. Of these, uh, here, farmer's hose. And we can't craft the uh, weaver spindle quite yet because you need one fiber resource. And to get that, we need to... Uh, Grow the uh, silkwood. So yeah, that's why that's we're doing the farmer first. Let's uh, promote somebody. Now another feature that I really want them to implement into the game is a way to get actually more than 
seven citizens because right now you're stuck with these seven guys you know a few hours in you really want to start expanding your uh, your territory so to do that you're gonna need more people and you're gonna it's gonna take a long time anyways I mean it'll speed up things exponentially it'll be great so hopefully that they'll work on that next so yeah we're gonna start uh doing some of the silkweed hopefully uh, it doesn't take too long I'll show you guys let's see if we can get uh, a goddamn soldier guy coming in here so Raven so basically a lot of our guys have jobs now we can't really quite yet craft the uh, weaver spindle because we need the fiber resource resource I'll try to find one of the plants like randomly oh there's some right here we can't get to that though can we okay let's see if we can get over there hold on to do that we're gonna have to actually where is it so maybe we can make some ladders down there is that you think we can do that guys possibly so if they're right here we're gonna have to make a ladder down here and then that from there we can go here Hopefully they'll do that. Is somebody gonna get on that? Of course not. Nobody's gonna get on that. They're all tired. And to get down there, we're gonna have to get this and here. And then we'll be able to get to these. Think they're gonna actually do that? Hopefully they will. Soon. At least I'd hope soon. So we've got two farmers. We've got the uh, the trapper. We got the workers. We got the soldiers. We got everything is dandy. Let's see if we caught. Oh, we caught something right here. Snare trap. All right. So yeah. I can understand how the trap works. Now you basically set out an area for him to put down traps, and he'll put down those traps. All right, so are you guys gonna go over there and like you know handle those wood? Oh Jesus! What was that? So yeah, guys, I think this is uh, I really don't think we're gonna get this out right now, but I really wish I could show you guys the uh, the weaver in that whole like new crafting thing. But you know what? I guess you guys are just gonna have to stay tuned for my let's play to see that the whole uh, they have a different crafting table. They got new animations. I don't know why, what, like, what is that? Fox jerky. Okay, we found fox jerky on top of a tree, guys. Congratulations. So, yeah. And, uh, yeah, to see all the, uh, new Weaver stuff, head on down to my new Let's Play that's gonna happen very soon. I hope to see you all there. I'll get a link in this, uh, at the end of this video, which will be awesome. So, uh, I'll see you guys all next time. Peace out.